Hey guys, I wanted to do another minimal um, video and talk about a few things that I do and that I'm um, trying to continue to do because I feel like it's it's a journey and we need to purge constantly. Um, so a few things that I have said to myself, one thing in, one thing out. If I get a new shirt, then I can purge a shirt or if, you know, make a Goodwill trip if I decide to buy a few outfits. Um, and today, I have not purged my closet since we started, uh, or since we moved to the farm, so I wanted to start doing that um, today and then just give you guys some ideas to help you get started with just sort of cleaning out and decluttering because it's really experiences and relationships that give us joy, um, not stuff. With that being said, let's get to it and I will show you um, sort of what I'm gonna do with my closet and my drawers. Okay, so here I am at my closet and like I said, I have not, um, since we moved to the farmhouse, I have not purged my closet yet. So here's sort of like three of my um, go-tos when I'm looking at a piece of clothing. If it does not feel good when it's on my body, get rid of it. If it has a stain, get rid of it. And if it's torn or, you know, an old white shirt that looks gray, get rid of it. If it does not make you happy and it does not feel good on you, get rid of it. And, and another rule that I, I have used lately is just having versatile clothing. I love tunics and leggings and you can dress those up and dress them down so easy. And I think when you have clothing that has versatility, you're not spending so much money, like one top for a party or one dress for a wedding. You can, you can use your clothes in different ways. So that's, that's been big for me. And again, I love the tunic legging, you know, dress it up with boots, dress it down with sandals, add a necklace. I love little ponchos. So here's um, my closet and it's really messy. And we don't have a coat closet in the farmhouse, so all my coats are in here too. What we do, okay, this is a pair of Wranglers. These fit me. They're not stained. They're not torn, but I don't wear them a lot. And they don't really make me happy, so I'm not gonna use them. These are cute little red, pinky, Will Smith tight. No, these don't make me happy either. And I really don't know why. These are Miss Me white jeans. There's mud on them. I can't have anything white, so that's not staying either. Another pair of white pants. Let's see if these have stains. If these don't have stains, maybe I'll keep one pair of white pants because maybe you just need one pair. Okay. Those passed the stain test. Now, I bought this coat a long time ago. It's cute. I like animal print. Did, have not worn it in a year, so it's leaving. That's another thing. If you don't wear something for a year, give it to somebody else, they will. I have a black vest like this already. So I'm gonna give this vest to someone else. Um, I have summer and winter. Okay, hadn't worn this in a year. This is a long brown sweater, cute, but it's not important to me or I would have already worn it. This was a really nice sleeveless dress that I wore to a wedding a long time ago. I don't like sleeveless on me and I have not worn this in five years. So that's gotta be purged. This is like my favorite. Johnny loves this dress on me, so I'm gonna keep that. Um, this was a yoga cover-up that I have not worn, so I'm purging that. But that's sort of <laughs> what I think we need to do every month. Um, go through your socks, you know, do these have holes in them? Um, if you like your socks to match, if you don't have matches, throw them out. How do your bras feel? Do, if they don't fit you right, if they're, if they don't make you feel good, get rid of them, because it just, clutters your mind it makes getting dressed longer i mean when i come to my dresser i open up and i have a choice of four bras that i can put on and or you know 
six yoga pants and that's it. So it doesn't clutter my mind and make me have to sit here and choose and choose and choose. I can just go to it and put it on and go about my day. And truly it is all about relationships and experiences, not your clothes. Okay, so I would love to know some of your purging ideas because I'm still learning, growing. I love purging my towels and my sheets, washcloths. That was great, that felt good. Um, but give me some of your ideas on how you purge kitchens, food pantries, whatever you do. Shoes, I need to do some shoes too. I have boots, I love boots, but I have too many boots. So we're gonna purge and give it to Goodwill. And tell me about your Goodwill shopping. I just experienced it like a month ago and was so, it was great that I could, you know, spend $20 and get like five items that I can use on the farm and wear and love, they make me happy. I had a black t-shirt with a little peace sign on it. I love that shirt. That shirt makes me happy. So let me know your ideas, like and subscribe. Thanks so much guys, have a good week, bye.